Hello everyone and welcome to a tweaking tutorial for your PC. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make your programs boot faster on Windows. This tweak does work for XP, Vista, and Windows 7 so it's pretty much a universal tweak. But the, before I get into the tweak I'm going to show you a demonstration of me loading Adobe After Effects CS4 without the, pa the patch or tweak and with the patch or tweak. So I'll be timing it and I'll show you guys how much time it is improved by and let's get started. So I'm going to open up Adobe After Effects CS4 and we're going to time it. This tweak works very well for Adobe products because Adobe products take a lot of PC power. Your processor has to be fast and you have to have a lot of RAM in order to use Adobe products. But if you don't have a strong computer, if you're on a laptop like I am, but my laptop is pretty good, but other than that, uh, it, it's crucial to have this uh, tweak on. So as you can see, it opened up fairly, fairly fast. Not bad, but with we're gonna apply the patch now. So the first thing you want to do is go to an icon such as the one on my desktop or one in the Start menu, and right-click on that icon and go to Properties. Now it'll bring up another window, and what you want to have a look at is the target location, not exactly the one up here, but the one right here, this target location right here. So what you want to do is click on it and go to the very end after the quotation mark here. Hit space, forward slash, and type prefetch, colon, one. Make sure you spelled that right, and you should be able to apply the patch correctly. Just click the apply button, click OK, and you've done it. All you have to do is open up your program, and it should load a little bit faster, if not a lot faster. So as you can see, I've opened up After Effects again and we're just going to see how fast this takes compared to the non tweaked version as you can see or what I can tell of it looks faster and it looks uh, a little bit faster yes it does look faster and there we go so if you guys like this tweak tutorial uh, please do leave a comment down below uh, please leave suggestions for any more tweaking videos in the future I hope I can do another series on this and I'll be starting a new series on Sony Vegas and Photoshop so if you guys would like to know anything about those programs please do watch my future videos and please comment, rate, subscribe guys and I'll see you guys in the next video